Hello and welcome, you are gaming with me, Brothgar, and welcome to the top 5 games made popular only by YouTubers in 2014. So while many of you might be expecting a grand lineup of AAA titles, such as Call of Titanfall, Grand Theft Resale, or The Assassin's Greed, such games as these have descended from the hills of hype, only to lather us up and bend us over for copious amounts of DLC. This list is not for them. This is for the games that have only barely made it to some form of release in the year of 2014, made popular only by us, the YouTubers. So get ready for a list that should be surprising to nobody. So starting off in first place is none other than the King of Ridiculous. Welcome to The Goat Simulator. This game goes to extreme lengths to prove that you do not have to have a polished game in order to make an entertaining one. But do not get me wrong, this is the most pointless game I have ever played. But why is it so popular? Well, the truth is it's absolutely ridiculous and provides an absolutely awesome backdrop for our favorite YouTube personalities. I kid you not, the pubes episode of this game was so well received and distributed among people that it actually made it to my coworkers. Mind you, these are people that do not even play video games. And here they are sharing it among everybody that they can get their hands on. I personally found that shocking. So while some may love it and some may hate it, the goat simulator will definitely be remembered for solidifying the term bait. Good time to mention that I live alone in my house and it's dark and there's lots of do- OOOH! BALLS! Jumping in at number 2 is none other than Five Nights at Freddy's. Now while this game is about as much of a technical achievement as the animatronics that scare the living daylights out of you, rest assured we have never spent more on a game that is contained only in a .exe file and doesn't even allow you to change the resolution. But what makes this game so attractive to YouTubers? Well it's pretty obvious, this game provides instant access to jump scares. Not only that, for those of you that are looking for the challenge of actually completing this game, YouTube provides a great place to find tutorials. Now while that is a good reason to be popular on YouTube, I don't believe it reached its level of insanity, all thanks to that. Oh no, Five Night at Freddy's, be it the first game, or the second game, or even the rumored third, has hit anybody who has ever thought of being a YouTuber with the YouTube fame Gold Rush. Oh yes, upload a video of this and you are guaranteed. 10 million subscribers. Don't believe me? Well that's alright, it's just a theory. A YouTube theory. Tired of working your desk job? Then by all means, jump on a plane and take a one way trip to the forest. A place that proves that parenting is overrated when you could better spend your time building a 5 star treehouse. Still not convinced? Well there are plenty of local natives that are definitely here to share their culture with you. Come see their local artwork, heads on a stick. And while you're here, take in a song or two. And if you're looking for some local beauty, you should check out the lady in the cave. She's got legs that go on for days. Now no joke, this game is actually fun to play with friends. Let's just hope it doesn't take till 2017 to get a stable version of the game. Because I'll be out of rabbits by then. The forest not doing it for you? Well, why not come take a look at the beautiful post-apocalyptic landscape of Charnas? This place is crazy. People are just making games that already exist. Is less more? Well, I'm not quite sure. You'll definitely get plenty of time to think to yourself as you move from one town to the other in the walking simulator 2014. If by chance you happen to cross another human in the game, by all means, make sure you're the one holding the gun. Unless, of course, you actually want to play the game without being a douche. No joke, when this thing dropped for early access, it blew up all over YouTube. That hype that had been building around DayZ, the mod, had just exploded once again and everybody was playing it, including me. But I gotta admit, it still needs a little bit of work. But don't worry, early access is all that's needed to get that YouTube money. Now while this next game might be a bit of a surprise for you that it is actually on the list, It'll definitely be confusing, because it's known by a couple of names. Formerly known as The Next Car Game, also known as Wreckfest, but officially known as Next Car Game colon Wreckfest. Yeah, at least for now. Because having a title and sticking to it is completely overrated. 
Now you might be sitting there thinking, you know what, that game is not as popular as the other four games you just previously mentioned. And you're absolutely right. But it's not so much how wildly popular this game is, although it is performing very well considering its genre. It is how it became popular on YouTube that makes it really stand out. Had this game released to early access in its alpha gameplay mode only, people would have picked up the game, played it, seen that it was bad without ever giving it a chance. But they did something that is absolutely brilliant. Along with the game, they also released a tech demo showing the full extent of their outrageous damage model in a very entertaining way. I mean, be honest, when's the last time you can drive your car into a robotic spider that smashes your car into oblivion? And for those of us that truly do enjoy a good automotive wreck fest, we got a lot of YouTubers to thank for bringing additional support to this game. Don't agree with my list? Well, make sure to rage about it in the comment section below. Extra credit for those of you that can use more than one exclamation mark while typing in all caps. But do bear in mind, we're all real humans here. So don't be a douche. And for those of you that might have found my pun jokes in a pellet of laughter, you might want to consider subscribing to my channel. I've put this nice button right on the screen just for you. I know it's hard to click, but if you find yourself enjoying this content and wanting to see more, that's the best way to do it. So whether it's the first time of many or the last time this year, I wish you a happy new year. Stay awesome, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Peace. Bratgar. Out.